What's up YouTube? So I purchased these four jaw harps in uh, Dan Moy Vietnamese instrument. Total price with shipping was about $56. You can buy them from Amazon, eBay. I bought them directly from a company in Russia. Uh, I will provide a link for that in the description. Buying them from the Russian website it is actually a lot cheaper if you're interested in several of these and they have a huge selection ranging from about six dollars to over a hundred dollars for per jaw hop and they also have sound files on their website so you can listen to what each instrument sounds like now my very first jaw hop was the uh, Snoopy's harp it really is just a toy harp and if you compare it in size it is much bigger in size sound wise there's just no comparison to to these real jaw hops and I will demonstrate that so here's a quick how to play a jaw harp you leave a gap between your teeth then you place the jaw harp on your teeth and close your lips around it Now you heard a metal sound, that's because the gap between my teeth wasn't big enough. Then you can change the tone by moving your tongue up and down. That was all done with the tongue. And by in an exhaling quickly, you can change the tone as well. So I'll start out with my favorite jaw harp. Let's give this a try. So let's see how the toy heart performs. There's just no comparison. Uh, there's no. I have no joy in playing this instrument anymore. I used to like it because I didn't know any better, but now I'll probably just get rid of this one. Disadvantages of the toy harp is it's harder. Actually, it seems more difficult to play. I have to pull harder. The sound it's not as loud. It's not as. It just doesn't sound as great. Um, so even as a beginner's jaw harp I would not recommend this considering you can buy one for 10 bucks you can buy a great one for less than $30 uh, what's the point of buying this in my opinion this is the deepest sounding jaw harp that I own it's built thicker the metal is thicker compared to the other ones uh, let's give this one a try I never find myself playing this one for a long time. 
it's not as enjoyable as the other ones. Still great to have it. I like to switch it up between the jaw harps. It just keeps it more fun. These two are very similar in, in built quality looks. Um, this one is, has a higher pitched tone. This one is actually my second favorite one in the bunch. Let's just start out with this one. Very easy to play, super small in size, very loud for its size. So that's my second favorite. First, second. And this is the other one. Same build pretty much. Um, they make the metals thicker, thinner to, to achieve different sounds. So here we go. <laughs> So here's the Dan Moy for five dollars. I figured I'd give this a try and actually like it quite a bit. Um, different with this one is you don't place it on your teeth, you place it on your lips. You well, I have a I keep a tight grip on here. I just touch it basically with my lips, and then you play. I don't know if you can pick that up. The Dan Moy is attached with a string to a carrying tube, which is in this case made out of bamboo. So here's a string. I pull pull it in for storage. And then you wrap it around. Oop. And then you can stick this end in here, and that's it. Safe storage. There are different ways to play jaw harps. I'm self-taught, so that's just the way I play. Um, what I like about the instrument is it's easy, very easy to learn. Uh, it's inexpensive. You can own five jaw harps for like 50 bucks. So thanks for watching, and thumbs up if you liked the video.